Rama has been one of Sundown's most reliable players over the last few seasons. Come rain or shine, he's been fit and ready for duty until midway through this season, where he was hit with a couple of blows that took him out of action at the wrong time. I think I won something like 55 games, and it's a good milestone for me. I can keep going and, and add to those things, but the body gets tired, and you, know, you are likely to break down and get injured. Injuries is not something that I'm really accustomed to, but they happen in football, you know, you have to be open-minded about it. They are part of this game, so you just have to make peace with it. Rama got a knock in training that ruled him out of the Telcom Cup final. Watching the final from the stands as the captain is a tough pill for anyone to swallow. The final was, was a good game. We started well with the early goal from Castro. And yeah, I mean, the, the, the hardest moment for me was when uh, the referee kept on giving penalties and silly fouls in front of the box. I said to myself, it's part of the game. And then when they missed the first penalty, you know, we're still in the game. And then when they missed the second one, that's when I said, this cup is ours. It was made for us. So there was no need for us to worry and then when you got the third goal and it was buried. He recovered from his quad injury just in time to take on Amakosi and then disaster struck again in his first game back. The injury second half, man, you know, when it happened, I was like, no, man, not again, you know, another setback. But I said to myself again, it's due to God's plan, man. Let me just go back again, treat this thing and come back strong. And, and yeah, I am today. But the bad thing about it was that, you know, he has just come off a, an injury. So the rehab was quite, uh, you know, mental. You know, coming off from a very bad injury, your first game, and uh, having a high ankle sprain, which is going to lay him off for about 12 weeks, it was quite bad, you know. So, but uh, it went very well, and he's strong mentally, so he did very well. It was quite a nasty ankle injury, as I'm sure most of the fans would have seen. And uh, we just followed the same process as any other injury. The player gets injured, the goal is getting him back as he was before the injury and if not better. Rama pushed in the initial six weeks, he researched his injury and put in the extra yards, which included swimming sessions to get himself to a point where the Sundowns fitness team could take over. In those six weeks, we started off mainly with balance work, getting that proprioception and all his neural firing going again. Once we were happy with his progress, we then started with some straight line running drills outside. That took about three weeks, I'd say, to get him from just jogging up into a full pace. Once he's running, then it's just a case of, of improving on what we've already done in the gym. So we've really built up basic balance work, basic strength. Then we look at increasing that level of conditioning in the gym as well. Also, once he's able to run straight line at a full pace, he then gets handed over to the conditioning coach, KB, who then pretty much progresses him into all the football specific stuff and eventually get him into playing games again. But while the defender wasn't on the field, he was approached to become a star on the runway at AFI's Joburg Fashion Week. A friend of mine from Love PSL gave me a call to say, the guys at Jockey, they've got a new range of vests and jockeys, so they wanted me to come and try them on. And then I said to this lady, ah, I'm not gonna be able to do that. I cannot walk uh, on stage in front of people uh, almost half naked. And then we went to Joburg for fittings with one of the best designers in South Africa, David Lale, and he said, you look good in them. Do you, do you mind coming to my fashion show and, you know, showcase my, my designs? I'm like, is it? Yeah. So I'm like, yeah, why not? Let's let's try it out. And while I was in the in the back room with the guys there, we were changing, and this guy asked me, are you a model? I said, no, I'm a footballer. And I said, I'm scared. I'm not going to come out. I, at some stage, I thought, I was going to tell the guy, look, I, I cannot walk naked outside there, you know. So I ended up saying to myself, whatever happens, happens. They've given me the, the tips and the tricks of modeling. I'm going to apply them and I walk. After his fashion debut, Rama walked on the field against Mbombella United in the Netbank Cup tie, fit and rearing to go. When the coach said to me, do you want to play against Mbombella? I said to him, yeah, let's, let's, let's try it out. And I looked at it as a game that I can use to come back because they're not as tactical and as highly competitive as other teams in the PSL. And I said to myself, I can use this platform to come back. And I had a good run, even though after 15 minutes, I started feeling tired. So that was the game that I made a comeback and I was very happy.
Rama's next two appearances in his comeback were high-pressure games. Wins in both meant the title race would gain serious momentum near the finish line. We knew that we cannot afford to drop points, you know, and the pressure was there, and that, that made us work hard, and we climbed it, we got the goals, and we got the win. And two days later, we, we had to go again, and we were at home with Cosmos, and same thing, we cannot afford to drop points. So that's the level that we find ourselves in, whereby every game is a final, and it demands you to work hard. With the captain fit, all the hard work paid off, and the Brazilians walked away with a title for an impressive seventh time, with two games still in hand. We've been working very hard together as a team, so you know we have to celebrate the success that we've achieved. You know, so I'm very happy for the team, and obviously, you know, the job is done now. I feel good, man. You know, when I when I remember when I got injured, you know, I just had to stay positive, and I came out of the injury and. I think I came at the right time, that's what makes me happy.